<laughs> I got three mystery elements. What happens when I combine them together? Four. <laughs> What's going on, YouTube? You're right here. You're back to another video. And today, I will be going over the Minecraft Education Edition on Minecraft Xbox Edition. Now, this isn't the CD edition. No, um, there's actually a little bit of a difference. This is the free version of Minecraft that came out a while ago, and this is also act. Uh, you can also access this through Minecraft PE itself. So yeah, um, I highly recommend you go check it out. There's some crazy cool stuff in this video, and um, yeah, uh, enjoy the rest of the video. So you simply turn on that. It'll give you a warning. Uh, that's uh, Let's see, what was it said on PC? No, desktop. So, best experiences on desktop, yada, yada, yada. I don't care, create. So basically what... All right, I am back and I have loaded my world and I went ahead and built a laboratory here. Just so, you know, um, because playing with elements and stuff in the open environment kind of isn't safe for the environment itself now, is it? So what I've done is built this laboratory and uh, what we have here are four different blocks. This isn't new. I just felt like putting that there for decoration. But we got the element constructor, the compound creator, the lab table, and the material reducer. Now, I've taken notes on how to get some of these elements. And trust me, there are a lot of elements. You ready to see them? Click. Yeah. That's ridiculous. So basically, you can acquire these elements through this piece here, the element creator. So we're going to uh, start off simple, and this is just a demonstration. There's so much you can make with this. So let's start off with trying to obtain chlorine. So for chlorine, it is 18 neutrons. So I think if I just, yep, that is overkill for this. Nope. So if you just click on this bar, if you're using the console or Xbox, that was just me trying to get through it easy. So there is 18 elect or 17 electrons here to make chlorine and 17 protons as well. And this will give you chlorine. So now that I have my chlorine, I can reset all of this. And now I can go and try to make sodium. So to get sodium, you will need 12 nitrogen. Wait, neutrons, 12 neutrons, not nitrogen. And I just passed what I needed to because I was focused on that. So 12 neutrons, um, 11 electrons, oh, there we go, and 11 protons. And this will give you sodium. And I just passed what I needed to. Surprise. Um, once you've done that, you got chlorine and sodium. And if you don't know what these two elements do, together they make salt. So you come to your compound creator here, and this gives you salt. So I'm going to grab a couple grains of salt here, and then you can just do whatever you want with that. So now that I've got salt, I can move over here if I do so choose. Now, let's say I don't want salt. What if I want my elements back? Or if I want to backtrace my elements? I can place it in this material reducer at the top, and it will say you use chlorine and sodium to make this. And if I want to, I can take it back out and say, okay, so this is the recipe I use to make salt. And there are a ton of elements and a ton of stuff I'm sure you can make with this stuff. So if you ever get the time, go ahead and mess around with it. Now, with that being said, there is this lab table. This, I'm not too sure what you're supposed to do with it. Now, it says combine here, and uh, obviously you got these elements, and the only thing that I've been able to fit in there are elements. So, I'm going to grab a few different elements, like, let me see, hydrogen and oxygen, and try to make Hydrogen and oxygen. That's hydrogen. That's nitrogen. Got to be careful. You're gonna, I'm going to blow the lab apart if I'm not careful. So hydrogen and oxygen. So 
What was that? I've got oxygen. I need to find hydrogen. Give me a half hour. Neon. Hydrogen. 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 There it is. So. And yes, these are blocks. You can't place them down and display them if you do so choose. So oxygen and hydrogen. And let's go ahead and stay back. That's it. That's. No, it's just garbage. So, yeah. It is nice to see a new, new, uh, something. Anyway. Um, yeah. So that was very boring. So let's add that. And can I add salt to this? Yes, I can. So what happens if I... Oh! What is that? Steam? Now, I'm not sure how well this is going to work. Probably not at all. But if you're not aware, salt has a melting point. And whenever you add it to water while it's melted into a liquid, it blows up. Now, I'm curious. If I get a cauldron... Of course, I don't know how to spell cauldron. I never have been able to spell it right. Cauldron, there it is. Such an odd way to spell it. But if I grab a cauldron and some water, and if I get some salt, will it blow up? So let's go ahead and, so can I just add it to this? No, I can't. Okay, that was a disappointment. But if you didn't know that, salt and mold, uh, melted salt and water blow, like it literally causes a reaction that blows up. Um, so yeah, it's, it's kind of scary. So what I'm going to do, I feel very mischievous. Now, I can't remember if I talked about this or not, but there is a mystery chemical or mystery element here. And as you can see, it's all question marks. So I'm curious, what happens if you set this single mystery element in by itself and combine it? Now, I must do the mad scientist laugh. <laughs> Oh, okay. That's kind of boring. So, with it being a mystery element, does it have different reactions each time? So, can I mix it? Can I combine it with itself? Do something awesome. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's just the fire. What? Oh. Yeah. Um, I didn't mean to do that. But these are just the basics on this. So I'm going to step away from that. I can't believe I just destroyed that, trying to put the fire out. But yeah, there is a ton. And oh yeah, I almost forgot bonus footage. We got two new mobs in the game. So we got the Phantom and we got the Panda. I want to see what the Panda looks like. Oh my gosh. This is adorable. What can I do with you? Comment what you think we should name them down below, but yeah, this is just this video is just an example I'm gonna get that um, Thing that the uh, yeah this So yeah, I highly recommend you go uh, Work with this yourself if you can highly recommend it Let me know what you guys find in the comment section, but yeah, let's move on with the fandom. Oh my gosh What were you? That's terrifying. What are you? I mean, other than a phantom, what are you? What? What? Oh, I fell into the chamber. What? What can you do? So if I go into survival mode, what will you do? Slash. Anyway, I'm getting off subject. Um, yeah, he's... That's creepy. Anyway, I think that's all for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. If so, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know what you guys discover with this um, chemistry thing in the comment section below. So, with the panda and the phantom in the background, this is Herobrine 2.0. Peace. <laughs>